I rushed back to Brooklyn to see the damage. The roof just collapsed. I'm just hoping and praying that it's not bad as what Thandy showed me on the phone. Kidding. Brace yourself. What the? You got a kidding me? Are you serious? Yeah. This is the area right here where the ceiling came down on me when I was cleaning. Like that whole thing oh, fell. Serious? Yeah. Can you imagine how scary that was for me? Kidding me? It's devastating. Ten years on this corner, we survived through it all. Cheers! Let's eat! Yo, I love y'all, man. <laughs> I want to say I love you guys. Cheers! Thank you, Lord. But Mother Nature, that makes me angry because I'm a winner. And today I just lost. So you mean to tell me all this came down in one day? Did it hurt you? Yeah, I was standing under the bar. It fell right on top of my head. But I just, I was just devastated. I didn't even want to be around anybody. I didn't want to talk to anybody. I just went home and I cried all day. This is, this is my baby. This is my restaurant. Like, look at it. Like, do you see this? The restaurant being destroyed is heartbreaking. The Pink Tea Cup is more than just a restaurant. It's where I find comfort. It's where I find solace. And the Pink Tea Cup is just like looking at Lawrence. I find comfort and I find solace right in Lawrence. So it's just a bond that will never break. It will never die. Come here, don't cry. And now that I'm seeing the business being destroyed, you know, it's just like not having Lawrence. It's the same thing. It feels like a piece of my soul is missing.